walk through the door Before you came, it was tears on the floor Girl, you so perfect, I think that it's working You gave me a love, now I really want more Girl, you so different apart from the rest Cool, I dropped out, I don't really take tests You gave me a love, I'm addicted like just Girl, I think you the plug, you the one with the best You did me Good morning, Junior High, and welcome to today's edition of Wildcat News. I'm Emily, and, and I'm Zoe, and we are your hosts for today. Today is Wednesday, May 22nd, and it is a B day. We got all the news you need to know and more coming right up. But first, as always, please stand for the flag salute. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. First up, here, in your club, here are your club and activity announcements for this week and next. Progress reports are the fourth marking period and will be available Thursday via Genesis. The Junior High Technology Club will meet today after school in room A13. The Lions Project will meet also today after school in the library. The Junior High Ach Achievement Awards will take place tonight in the auditorium at 6.30 p.m. And the Art Club next meeting will be Thursday, May 30th after school in room B20. Now time to find out what the cafeteria is cooking up. Let's go to Clayton who has the details. Good morning, Wildcats. Today for lunch, we're going to have stuffed shells with garlic bread, cheese sticks on a torpedo roll, chicken tenders, and your choice of milk. And now let's go to Elijah, who has the update on our weather forecast for today and tomorrow. Hey, Wildcats. Today's going to be sunny with a high of 76, and tomorrow will be sunny with a high of 80. Back to you guys at the studio. Thanks, Elijah. Well, that brings us to the end of our show. From all of us in the TV studio, thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching. Have, have a wonderful, wonderful Wednesday. You did me wrong.